Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jacqueline with Universal Intuition and today's video is going to be for all you Sagittarius out there. This is going to be your love reading for the month of August. First card is going to be the mutual energy between the two of you. Second card is going to be you. Third card is going to be how they feel about you. And then the fourth card is going to be your outcome. And of course I'll pull an angel card at the very end. Um, Alright, so let's get into it. Sagittarius. What do we have for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the month of August? Love reading, Sagittarius, month of August. What messages do we have for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus in the month of August for a love reading? The mutual energy between the two of you guys is the king of pentacles you guys are balling right now you guys are feeling really good about one another you guys are feeling established you guys are really um, working hard at your jobs at your home um, to make your relationship happy you're feeling um, y'all are both feeling just on top of the world you've got everything at your fingertips um, you guys are working well together. You guys are communicating very well. This is a very good energy um, to share for mutual. Beautiful. And then um, you guys' card is how y'all are feeling is Sagittarius. Y'all got the world. The world card is beautiful. You guys are um, totally happy, feeling like you have, all again, all the elements and everything at your fingertips. You're supported by your friends, family, um, your career. Everything is really just going good for you guys. Um, you're completing like a really big cycle right now of fulfillment, complete completion, joy. Like you're feeling all the things. August is like a really, really good, fulfilling month for you. Um, you're financially supported. You're loved. You're adored. People look at you and they're kind of almost jealous because I mean you've got the world really so all right and then how they feel about you is they got the devil you guys could be dealing with a Capricorn um, if that's not the case um, there's something a little bit toxic about the person that you're dealing with um, they might have some kind of um, addiction um, as far as and that could be electronics like they're addicted to their phone or they're addicted to whatever it doesn't mean that they're like addicted to drugs it could be um, that's not always the case don't be scared of the devil card um, it's just here to remind you to really just to take a step back or for this person they need to kind of take a step back on whatever they're kind of overindulging in. Um, they could be, I'm really being drawn to look at the couple at the bottom. Um, I'm feeling like they're really addicted to you. Like they're really addicted to the relationship or like they're really um, intense right now. And they may be, you know, because you're not really looking at them. You're kind of looking over here like, yeah, we're happy because you know, we've got a nice house and we have nice things and we work really hard for what we, um, for what we have. Um, but the person that you are dealing with is, um, they're, I feel like their attitude, like they're not being a devil, like they're not being mean or anything like that. Um, I just feel like they're just overindulging just a smidgen. <laughs> um, and that could be with you. Again, I'm feeling like electronics keep coming up for some reason. Um, like they're just like on their phones a lot or on the internet or on, you know, doing something like that. Maybe you guys are watching too many, <laughs> um, too many inappropriate things on the internet, that kind of thing. I don't know. That's just the vibe I'm feeling. But, um, yeah, but the overall outcome that I have for you guys is the five of cups, but it's in the reverse. Um, so I feel like there was a little bit of disharmony, a little bit of sadness, um, maybe you know about what this person's addiction is and that was that was making you feel kind of down and sad like you weren't you know almost in a depression state like not fully but you were feeling like man this isn't cool like at all that this person's doing this but 
Um, with the outcome of this card being uh, in the reverse, I feel like you guys are coming out of that. I feel like the person that you're with knows that they need to take a step back from whatever they're overindulging in. And once that happens, um, they will be released from that energy. So, and bottom of the deck is two of cups. This is very good. You guys are have a very good overall love for each other. Um, very... Um, I don't want to say fully balanced, but y'all are like getting there. Y'all are getting to like a really balanced um, spot in your relationship uh, coming up here pretty soon in the month of August. So awesome. Very good, Sagittarius. Let's see what the angels have to say. Sagittarius, sun, moon, rising, and Venus for the month of August in love. What do the angels have for Sagittarius for the month of August? make a wish <laughs> beautiful you guys literally whatever it is was the first thing that came to your mind when someone says make a wish whatever it is is it love is it a new job more money is it a vacation whatever that is think about it see it coming true in your mind Take a deep breath in and then release the outcome to the angels. And now they have it for you guys. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All right, Sagittarius, I hope you like this reading. Please uh, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next video.